tennis is a game of control. Sit down. Speed and footwork. Palmeron has a great notion of the speed and control of the game. He has replaced his footwork with the wheelchair, which have made him into a Paralympic athlete. An honor. I, I, I never dreamed of it. Um, you know, uh, did, didn't see myself as an Olympic uh, potential type athlete growing up. Paul is a five-time Paralympic athlete. He spent most of his Paralympic career competing in seating volleyball. But when he started to see his tennis game improved, he decided to pick up his racket and head to Beijing. I realized my tennis game was getting good enough that you know, maybe if I just focused on tennis like all the other guys I play against, uh, realized that there was a lot more potential there. Paul's success as a Paralympic athlete was born from an accident nearly 25 years ago. Kind of the same phenomenon, like the patio door is open and you walk into the screen door and you got your nose mushed up, except for I bounced into the path of a light rail vehicle, which really aren't that light if they're on top of you, which it was for about 40 minutes that night. Paul is not only an example when hitting forehands and backhands on the court, but he's an example outside the court. He spends a lot of his time talking to children in school and is now part of the push to bring the 2016 Olympic and Paralympics to the city of Chicago. In the meantime, Paul prepares for his possibility of competing in London in 2012 and has no regrets about his disabilities. Instead, it has inspired him to his success.